All right, the big story of the day because in a few hours from now, we are counting down the time precisely at 2.35 p.m. this afternoon. India's third mission to the moon will take off from the launch pad of the Satish Dhawan Space Station in Sriharikota. The countdown is on and a billion hopes and prayers that are behind the launch of Chandrayaan-3 mission. From entering into the orbit and landing on the moon, the mission will take 42 days. The landing that is slated for the 23rd of August at the lunar dawn and the mission that aims to achieve what its predecessor could not and that is to land softly on the lunar surface and explore it with the rover now a successful soft landing will make india the fourth country after the united states russia and china to achieve this feat let's take a look at the capabilities of chandrayaan 3 mission and what we are looking forward to india is all set for a galactic feat we are aiming for the moon literally with the launch of chandrayaan 3 Today in this Time Zone special, we are going to tell you all you need to know about this special mission, the features and the changes that have been made from the Chandrayaan-2 mission. Chandrayaan-3 is India's third lunar exploration mission taking off in the LMVM-3 launcher. This is the operational heavy lift launch vehicle of ISRO that has completed six consecutive successful missions. The height of it is 43 and half meters and it weighs 1749.86 kgs including the rover. The rover has a mission life of one lunar day which is 14 Earth days. But now let's talk about why the mission is so crucial and how it's going to be significant, the journey of it and what it means for India. Now there's a reason why this date has been chosen. Uh, let's talk about the mission. The journey is pretty long for Chandrayaan-3 as it has to travel 3.84 lakh kilometers. According to scientists, just over 16 minutes into the flight, the rocket will eject the Chandrayaan-3 spacecraft at an altitude of about 7, 179 kilometers. The spacecraft will orbit the Earth five to six times in an elliptical cycle with 170 kilometer closest and 36,500 kilometers farthest from the Earth moving towards the lunar orbit. Now the goal of this mission is to place a lander and rover on the lunar surface. But there's also a reason why this specific date has been chosen for the mission. That's because the Earth and Moon would be closer to each other during the part of the year. So after a journey of the long 3.84 lakh kilometers, the lander that is carried by the spacecraft is expected to make a soft landing on August 23rd or 24th. And after reaching, it will begin a soft landing on the South Pole region of the Moon. This mission is divided into three phases, Earth-centric phase, lunar transfer phase and the Moon-centric phase. The Chandrayaan-3 lander and rover are similar to the previous mission. Remember, in 2019, Chandrayaan-2 had lowered itself to within three miles of the Moon. But unfortunately, due to a software glitch, we are off the course. But scientists have assured us that lessons have been learned and the lander software has been upgraded. A successful soft landing will put India in an elite league. It will make India the fourth country after United States, Russia and China to achieve the feat. So with bated breath, we await the launch and the landing. But in the meantime, let's take a look at how Chandrayaan-3 is different from Chandrayaan-2. With a total payload that has increased by 50 kgs, however, the weight of the payload is slightly more than the previous mission, probably due to the modifications that have now been made for a safer landing. The Chandrayaan-3 will take at least six lesser days to reach the moon as compared to its predecessor. The current mission seems to be not carrying on an orbiter. It will also use the data from Chandrayaan-2 orbiter. And the excitement is not just limited to India. There is an outbeat diaspora who couldn't contain their joy when Prime Minister Modi in Paris mentioned about India's giant space leap. And you will be happy when I am talking to you now, there is a lot of pride in Chandrayaan 3. चंद्रयान थ्री की लॉन्चिंग के लिए रिवर्स काउंटिंग की गुंज सुनाई दे रही है 